What's up everyone? This is CN Skyima and welcome to CN Figures Episode 3. Figures that you've seen before, figures that you never seen before, figures that you want so bad you wanna get them. And for this tour review, we are looking to Byakugan figure Preyes. And man, this figure is really, really freaking big. And the first time I just put it around, they only show me like a little piece of him. It didn't show the head. It should only show like a half of the body, but not the head or the arms, anything. So, praise. And still, I don't have a ruler, so I don't know how tall it, this guy is. Uh, pretty much, it's a good figure. And I see that nobody did a tour review of Preyes around. So pretty much, it's the first time you guys are watching Preyes. The Byakugan sea creature. And pretty much, this is Marucho's Byakugan creature. And I really love Byakugan. And I cannot, I cannot tell which cartoon that I love. Pokemon, Digimon, or Byakugan. But pretty much there, all the cartoons are cool. Pokemon and Digimon, I grew up in those times. And, well, I started watching Byakugan like, I think like seven years ago. And, I don't know which cartoon I like. So, you guys, what's your favorite cartoon? Like, Pokemon, Digimon, or Byakugan, like Moksuno? Just leave in the comments. Okay, and this figure did not keep any accessories around. So let's look around, let's talk about it, what this figure does. And pretty much look at the spikes of this toy. See? Huh? And also the great job they did in the blue one, see? The blue spikes around. And pretty much I like this color. I love blue a lot. And blue here. And we can tell there's spikes in the front. There's spikes in the front. And pretty much, I love it. Let's go about here. Let's put his, down, his arm down. This is not kind of pointy, but it's kind of, I don't know, like plastic. I don't know what kind of material they use for this figure. I think, yeah, I think it's plastic. And so this is with the fence too. Plastic. Past the here and look at the hands. See, there's kind of fish hands around here. And there's his nails, but not that pointy nails. So what this figure does, he can move his arm up, down, up and down. No, up and down, up and down, up and down. You can turn his arm around. And also they said, I see you can do, I see they use the exact same materials around the head just like these. Now let's talk about the legs. You cannot turn the foot around, so you need to do this. This is his whole leg, you can turn around. And send it for this one. But I can't tell how tall this guy is. But this is praise. And you also can take the head off. So let's talk about the head right now. See? You see that you did a great job modeling this figure, his mouth, see? Uh, but pretty much it was like kind of hard work it did. So look at the teeth, see? Look at the teeth. Pretty much it took like hours doing the teeth because you know he always like show his face like this in the cartoon. And also you can see some spikes here. Tiny ones. I think this is dark blue around. And look at his eyes. Red. Black here. And here's on the bottom head. And see there's a hole. And I see there's he used the exact same material doing that. Doing this. Pretty much I love it. A lot. And look at the round this head when you pull it out. I think it's kind of like this color blue. I think it is, so let's put his head back. It's gonna be hard work putting this set. Ah, 
there. Let's do it. In the tail, you cannot move it. See? You can't move it. So, what this tail does, you can't pull it out. See? There's a hole and there's a tail. And it's great because the tail is not that pointy. I see you can move the tail around like this, like twisting it, like bending it around. And pretty much I love it. I love this figure. I love this. I love Biakogon, but I cannot tell which one I love the most. But I think these figures are so hard to find anywhere around. You can find them in Toys R Us. I think Toys R Us used to sell them because I bought this one on the mall. And the guy told me that it's not going to bring no more Biakogon toys anymore because nobody buys them. And pretty much... He wasn't alone. The guy told me they used to have Drago. And they say that Drago was sold out, so the only one I just got was Preyus. So these figures are so hard to find. Oh yeah, let's talk about the feet. You see? Kind of look like human hands. See? Oh yeah, and the spikes from the tear. I almost forgot the spikes from the foot. Not that pointy and not that pointy from around here. They don't hurt you. And the nails of the feet. Yep, they look like hands, but kind of look closey hands around. So, I don't know how tall this guy is because I don't have a ruler around. And it'll be great if, if Biakogon, the guys who created the cartoon of Biakogon, if you guys are watching this video, hear me out, guys. Do not do figures of the Biakugan Beast, okay? Do the figures of the Biakugan Brawlers like Dan Kuso, Marucho, Jun, Mira, Fabia, pretty much everyone. I'm talking about all the characters. You guys should make the figures of the characters, not just the Biakugan creatures or Biakugan Beast. Doesn't matter, guys. You sure make the Bagelgon characters to figures. Pretty much, I'm I'm a big fan of Dan, Mira, Fabia, um, Shun, and and some other girl. But this girl, so that's kind of she's a bad girl. The woman has like kind of blue hair. I'm also a fan of her. So I don't know her name. So you guys should make. The characters of the Biakugan, not just the beast. And also do the rest of the characters. I'm also talking about the beast now. Uh, right now, I'm talking about the you guys should make the Biakugan creatures figures like Tigra. You see Aquamos, the little frog Biakugan, the one Marucher has. I don't know her name. Pretty much I forgot. I think being like two years, I never watched Biakugan anymore. So pretty much, I'm gonna see it right now because I don't, I don't watch the complete set. I just see it's like episode by episode. So let's look around this figure just one more time before I go. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more of my videos around, guys. Man, this guy's so big. And I don't know how tall Drago is. Pretty much it's bigger like this size, like around like you see me zoom in on the camera. And pretty much it's kinda of big, like almost passing Preyus. Yeah. So part of you guys never saw this guy. They did a tour of you of Preyus. It's kinda of cool, isn't it? So there you have it guys. Biakugan figure praise. Remember I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. And my last tour reviews I did was Quan Chi and Shadow Hedgehog from Sonic the Knights of the Wind. So please guys, check those videos out. And probably I will do, let me see, 
Oh yeah, like I said, maybe I would do Sonic to review. Okay, guys. So this is Sin Skyma and Prayers. We are out in line. Take take care, guys. If you have a Bagel Gun toy and which are your favorite Bagel Gun characters and who you think should make to an action figure, leave in the comments, guys. Okay, so again, this is Sin Skyma. And praise, we are out in line. Take care, everyone, and I'm out.